good day viewers. Welcome to Better Faith e-learning platform. Our subject, I am Ezo Emery by name and I'll be teaching you English language. Our topic for today is adverb. What is an adverb? An adverb is a word that is used to qualify or modify a verb, an adjective or other adverb. In other words, an adverb gives you more meaning, it adds meaning to the verb, the adjective or other adverb. It gives you additional meaning to what is being said. We have different types of adverb. We have adverb of time. What is adverb of time? We use this adverb every time. Unknown to us that this is an adverb of, or this is an adverb of time. An adverb of time tells you when something happened. It answers the question when. When something happened. For example, if I should ask you, where did you meet him? You can say, we met last year or we met in Lagos. We met last year in Lagos. The last year there, for example, tells you the time we met. Or I will be leaving your house tomorrow. It tells you the time I'm leaving. So the adverb of time answer the questions, the question when. When are you going? I am going now. I am going tomorrow. I am going next year. So these are examples of adverb of time next year this morning last year in the afternoon these are what adverb of time i will also have adverb of place it tells you where something happened where it answers the question where for example if i should ask where is brian brian is inside it answers the question where this inside here is the adverb of pl place the inside here is adverb of place. We also have other adverb of place like Brian is in Lagos. Brian is, is in Abuja. Adverb of place tells you where something happened. Coronavirus started in China. So these are what adverb of place. Where did the thing happen? Where it really happened? That is for the adverb of place. And adverb of frequency, it is used to describe how often something occurs. How often something occurs. She always talks. Always there is the adverb of frequency. She often eats. So the adverb of frequency is used to describe how often something occurs. For example, we have an example here. Mary always sings. So the adverb of frequency will tell you how the, the person since maybe she's not Alan. like we have here Mary always sing always there is the adverb of frequency and number four type of adverb we have there is adverb of manner I said that the adverb of manner is used to describe how something is being done or how something was done for example he drives slowly he writes neatly these are what adverb of manner how he drives he drives slowly he's a reckless driver he's he talk quickly he does his things quickly he's very fast so these are what adverb of manner telling you how something is being done we also have adverb of degree the adverb of degree reveals the extent of an action the extent of an action that is the adverb of degree extent of an action a good example she is very lazy i can say she is lazy but when i put this very lazy there it's telling you the extent of her laziness she is extremely wicked she is very good so these are example of adverb of degree it tells you or it reveals the extent of an action and to practice what we have been taught, I'm going to give you an assignment 
that you are going to do at home when we resume hopefully you are to submit your assignments now you are to write out five examples each using the different types of adverb for the adverb of time you have to give me five examples like my own idea we just one day we met last year you have to give me five examples write it down adverb of time give me five adverb of place five adverb of frequency you have to give me five adverb of manner and degree five each thank you